Hey guys, this is Versatile from VSC Power I'm now hosting on Project Phoenix Media. In today's video game tutorial for your custom firmware PS3 or jailbroken PS3, I will show you how to properly copy over those PS3 games that are larger than 4 gigabyte file sizes and transfer them to your external FAT32 format hard drive. So how does this work? So in today's example, we're going to use a program, it's called Split 4G, and we're also going to use another example game called God of War Ascension. And basically, this game has one particular game file that is like over 9 gigabytes. And on a FAT32 system, it does not allow you to copy over that kind of file. And I'm trying to find that file right here real quickly here. And it's like right here, this PSARC file, 9 gigabytes. Not good. So what we're going to do is using the Split 4G program and using your FAT32 format external hard drive, we're going to copy over the file. So how does this work? So go to the more info section, there's a link to download the Split 4G program. Go ahead, download, extract it, and run the executable. Now, it's going to ask you for the source game folder. The easiest way, is I just click in here, just find it. So I'm going to go to temp here. Here's the game. Click OK. So that's the, the root. Destination game folder. So let's go ahead to my external hard drive. It's going to be um, down here. And it's going to be right here. And there's a folder called games. Double click on that. Click OK. Here you want to say the file name is this dot six 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 pound pound sign, and then click on Start. And then it's going to say Source folder contains one big file. That's correct. Click OK. Now it's going to go ahead and, and it's going to go, going to do the process of copying the files over and splitting them accordingly for your external hard drive. Once this whole process is done, 30 minutes or how, however long it's going to take, once that process is done, then you go to your PS3, load up Multiman, insert your external USB hard drive. Multiman will say, oh, this game is a split game. Do you want to copy it to the internal hard drive? And there you want to say yes. It will copy those files over to your internal hard drive. It will merge them, and then your CFW PS3 will play them fine. So with that said, let's jump straight into the next portion of this gameplay footage tutorial and show you how that process works. Let's do this. Okay, in this next portion of the game tutorial, I'm going to show you how to take your split game that's currently on your external hard drive. So here's my one terabyte external hard drive connected to my CFW, CFW Fat PS3. And we're going to go to the game section and go into Multiman. And using the Multiman program, I'll show you how to transfer that program and install it properly to your internal hard drive. Okay, great. So let's go to the game section here. Here we see is God of War Ascension, and we see that it currently says split. So what we're going to do is we're going to press X on my game controller. It's verifying the data. Now it's going to ask you to do pre-processing. So let's go ahead, install the required data to internal hard drive. Press X on yes. It's setting the permissions. It's only going to do this once, and then it is going to go ahead and copy the necessary files to your internal hard drive. One thing I do want to note that I just recalled, if you have like a Blu-ray disc of a game, and if you try to copy it to external USB hard drive, it may not allow you to do that, and it may prompt you to install that game directly to the internal hard drive. But in this particular case, it's a little bit different. Here we have a game that is has files that are much larger than 4 gigabyte format for FAT32 file system. So using the Split 4G program, we split those files, put it on external hard drive, connect it to your PS3. Multiman is smart enough to understand what you're trying to do, and then it will install the necessary game files to the hard drive cache. Once this process is done, we'll be on our way to playing this game and have a lot of good times for the USB external hard drive. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video momentarily. Once this process is done to installing the game files to the hard drive cache, then I will resume the video and I'll show you the next steps. Let's do this. Alright, so apparently after it finished that copy process, it just kicked me back out to the main XMB main screen, which is fine. And I go up here and I see that it has already pre-mounted the game for me. So let's go ahead, run the game real quick, and let's see what's, what it is going to show me next. Okay, so there's the latest game update. So we got to go ahead and download the game update. For sake of time, what I will do is I will edit the video footage just to skip ahead a little bit. And then we'll get to the next part of this uh, video and see how well the game works uh, off the internal slash external hard drive system. All right, sweet, it's done. Let's test this out real quick before my camera battery dies. Let's go ahead. 
See if I can skip the movies. Maybe, maybe not. Wow, there's a lot of preloading here. Oh yeah, it looks like it's working guys. So that is today's video game tutorial showing you how to use the Split 4G program. Transfer your games from computer to a USB hard drive format as FAT32. And then copy it over to your FAT PS3 or some PS3 and have a lot of good times. So you guys have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.